What is going on guys? Welcome back from another video on myself, Obsidian Gaming, and today we have a great little game for you to try out. It's over on Steam at the moment for £1.69, so if you like your bargains and getting your money's worth out of the game, this is definitely one for you. I've played a little bit of it, and I've got to say, I'm absolutely loving it. It's really simple, but satisfying at the same time. I think the developers have done a really, really good job at it. And also, I'd like to say a big thank you to Aki Mailer for the key, and also the developers of this game, which is Jolly Crew and media so a big shout out to you guys thank you very much for the key i really do appreciate it now let's go through the blurb meet dude so dude is this little guy here trying to navigate the challenges of a physics-based life enter stage left zoom blizz. find your path through a series of dark dungeons and out into the light learn the ways of the world and help dude achieve personal growth and realization it's a physics-based puzzle platformer where each type of Zoobly has its own behavior. So there's different, basically there's different types of Zooblies. Like you can see here at the moment, you've got the three Frankenstein heads there, just stay still. You've got this one, Wings, which is pretty much like a flying bat, which just goes to and from. And you have a couple of little speed ones and a little bouncing ones, a bit like from Mario back in the day with the bird, little turtle thing with the wings. It's a little bit like them. When dude moves, time moves. When dude stops, time stops and as the player can drag and rotate blue things only the blue things to wherever you want to your advantage right okay so basically what we got to do is get dude over on this side here and we've got to get into that door over there now what it means by when dude moves time starts and stops it's pretty much when i walk left or right as you can see it moves if i jump in the air and i let go it will stop so it gives you time then to then adjust things that you need. For example, the blue platforms, I'll show you a little bit later on with that one as well. But honestly, I'm really enjoying this at the moment. Also, when you stop, it'll show you the arrows in which way things will go before them. We need to try and get a star before we get out, but you don't need to get the star. You can just run back past it if you really want and get over there, but we want to get the star, don't we? If you want to move time on its own without moving dude himself, you press this little glass here, it'll move on its own. So we'll go up and down this way. And let it come near us and hopefully jump over. And can we make it? Cool, there we go. Easy as that. Like I say, it's an easy game. It's very satisfying. So we're on a little bit of the tutorial bit at the moment. These are the blue things. If I wanted to get up onto there, I could just jump on like so. Let these guys keep moving them, hopefully. Bit more of a push, so that I can make that star jump. Woo, just passed. I told you, it's a really satisfying game. I'm actually really enjoying it. Oh, right, okay, this one looks a little bit more trickier. The only thing is, you can't press down on the D-pad. There's nothing for down. So when you're in mid-air like so, instead of pressing down like you normally would, you just gotta press that one, I'll just keep the one up. What is the worst that's my game? Oh crap. That's not good, is it? Ah! We're dead. Right, so we need to make sure we get them perfect. Not like that. <laughs> in time right can we move that no oh. does that kill you i'm gonna give it a try i'm gonna try and jump onto it that didn't work did it all oh, right okay so you stick to it a little bit okay and the blue one still killed you you can't stand on top of them but we can move it though so if we move it like there to get the fall just right don't we Do that if we don't do it this time, we've just got to go 
go out with the star. Oh, there we go. That's the done. If you do end up purchasing this game, or have you played it before, let me know down in the comments as well. How did you get on with it? Did you find it as addictive as what I have? Right, this thing here, we can try and drop it onto that, I think. So I'm going to try and see if we can stop it going in. A little bit of time going in. Move it down. A little bit more. And we can actually turn these as well, these little blue bits. Just to help you. Right, okay, there we go. So we've got it trapped. Oh, I'm trapped as well. Oh, not good. Right, maybe, because we need to get that star, don't we? We can only use this once. If we can hopefully jump on to get into there. Good. A little bit of pressure on now with this thing behind us. Nicely done. Turn it on its head. Right. Turn it on its head. So at the start of each level as well, it gives you a little bit of a clue. Right. Then, will it kill us if it's on its head? Yes, it does. Okay. So we can't like cut through anything, it's got to be literally enough of a gap for it to fit. I'm hoping that will work. Yeah, right, we can push this bit over. Oh, that's not good, is it? <laughs> again. So if we come down this way, we try and keep that up. So that keeps us flat platform. So we need that platform there, don't we? Well, I think I need to get that over towards the star. I think I need to be careful of is it doesn't nudge too far away. Perfect. Can we jump up on there? We've got enough jump? No. We need to get that back then, don't we? Will it eat some? Will it eat? Oh, yeah, okay, it eats the block as well. <laughs> Remind yourself, don't push the red block in. Oh my god, it's happened again.
All right. A little bit more. Really is. <laughs> now let's jump again. Oh, it's all gonna throw me up. Right. I think we just fluked the black one a little bit. What do you guys think? Do you think we fluked it? That's what I need to do is. Jump, put it right below us, and then over. Don't you love it when a plan comes together? Oh, I can't drop here where these go before then. Close. Right, escort that one over there. That's got to eat all of these. I'm gonna take 
take it. If we get them to drop right down. Now will they drop? Oh, they are. Okay, let's go carry on eating. Let's <laughs> go carry on eating, obviously. Okay, he's eating a blue bit as well. Oh, no. Right, I need that out of the way. How good? Oh, I know. Right, so we need to get that escorted to eat that one and then to eat the bottom one. That's real clever, that. I like the way they're doing Oh no, he's not worked. to that because that will kill me. Okay, we had it right. That's what we needed to do. Stick you up there. Slightly off. Just give me enough time to get past. Whoa! No, he killed himself then. Don't want that. Maybe 
<laughs> not do that. Try it again, shall we? There we go. Got there in the end. This next one, knock it out. I bet you some people are screaming at the screen like, Don't do it that way! Don't do it that way! It's always the way, isn't it? When people can see it a little bit different from what you can. Ah, wait. Can that happen? Yes, it can. I'm going to leave it there on the video. Uh, we've done about 20 minutes or so on the video, so thank you very much if you made it all the way to here. Let me know if you purchased this game yourself. Have you played it? What's your thoughts on it as well? And if you did enjoy it, let me know by hitting that like button. And I'll see you again next time. As always, stay safe, take care of yourself, and I'll see you again. Bye for now.